This is my brother Raymond. Welcome to the path, Raymond. Look at this book Deborah gave me. 101 healthy things to do in the kitchen. In this kitchen, the healthiest thing to do is wee. <laughs> Deborah's cooking, yay, yay, yay. Oh, I am tired, sweetness. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. oh, baby, does that feel good? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Give me those pants. I'll wash them. Well, that's okay. No, I'm washing those pants for you, damn it. Mom. Take off your pants! <laughs> Could we turn the heat up? You can only push a man so far! He's not that big of a deal. Calm down. Traitor! <laughs> You can never talk to me about my parents again because in this case, you are the backer downer. I warned you, I warned you, now get out. I am not getting, what are you crazy? Are you, take it back, take it back. Just give me back, this is my shower. Show me, show me, show me, show me. And I'm going to get, can I take this back? Show me, show me, show me. You drop it first. And we will both drop it at the same time. Are you right? On the count of three, one. Two, three! <laughs> <sighs> yes! That's right! Yes! That's right! TV, VCR, it's all you care about. I swear, Ray, the only time you call me during the day is when you want me to tape stuff for you because you're running late. Not stuff. Games that I have to watch for work. Okay, so I can buy food and electricity for the children. Right, so I should go to work and raise the kids, all right? It should be all me, yeah. And what do you do all day? I'm sorry. Excuse me? I'm sorry. That's right, you're sorry. That's right, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah but look, look at this. What? You're in jail. <laughs> Going on 10 years now. Yeah. You know, Robert, it sounds like you kind of miss Amy. Why don't you just give her a call? Do you think she wants me to call her? Oh, do you want to call her? What, do you think she still likes me? You still like her? <laughs> oh, my God. Well, why don't you wait till your acne clears up? Give her a ride on your skateboard. <laughs> oh, listen, listen. Uh, on the first date, it doesn't matter what you do on the date. It all comes down to saying goodnight. Right. Are you going to kiss her goodnight, or is it going to be a handshake? You know, you can't assume that she wants a kiss. So, so well, you, this is what I do. When the moment arrives, you kind of lean in a little, you know? You, yeah, you got to see if she's going to respond to it. Don't go too far, though, because you reach, like, a certain point, and you got to go in. You're committed. And then if she's not expecting a kiss, then you got to whisper something in her ear. Boy, it's humid. <laughs> OK, I appreciate all the advice. That's great. I, uh... It's easy for you, Raymond. You fit in everywhere. You're a 40 regular. Uh, you know where I had to go for this suit? Little shop of horrors. All right. You thought I couldn't turn down Deborah, right? Two times, my friend. Yeah, last night I told her that I had a lot of work to do today. <laughs> work. And then, and then, first thing this morning, she started hinting again. She, she even brushed her teeth and everything. But no sale. Oh, it's amazing. It's like, it's like every time I turn it down, she seems to want it more. She's like a guy. <laughs> huh. But she's not getting upset? No, 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 that's just it. She's been treating me better all day. I came down this morning, she was making me a cheese omelet. I mean, she hasn't done that since before Allie was born. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it had shells in it, but still. <laughs> Deborah can't keep her hands off me. It's like with the power of no comes the power of yes. Uh-huh. For the first time in my marriage, I finally know what it's like to be the one wearing the panties. But let me ask you something. Why do you always feel the need to be manipulative when it comes to sex? Because I'm not very good at it. 